If you're watching this video now, you're probably wondering how to upload your first video ever to YouTube. And don't worry about that because in this video, I'm gonna walk you through a few tips and tricks that are gonna get your video uploaded and optimized in no time. So stick around and watch this video till the end. What's up guys and welcome to the channel. My name is Nader and here on Prodvigate, I help you build your YouTube channel from the ground up. So if you're new here, please click subscribe and activate the bell so you don't miss out on anything. And now let's get into it. So to upload your video, you're gonna head over to this camera and then click on upload video. So then you can select files and choose the file from your computer. All right, so this is the file and then we click upload. As simple as that. So in in, at this stage, we can actually do everything. We can select keywords, we can do the title, the description, but I don't really prefer, you know, doing anything at this stage rather than just click on no, it's not made for kids because my content is not for kids. And then I can continue by clicking next. I'm not going to do anything here, so I'm just going to let everything be at the end. But here we can schedule or keep the video private. So if you don't know when to publish or to post this video, I really recommend you uh, selecting private or you can schedule the video uh, at the time uh, you want to post it. So let me select the time, all right, and then we click schedule. So while your video is being uploaded, we're gonna head over to YouTube Studio. We're actually uh, at the studio right now. And here is the video. All right, it's being uploaded. So while the video is being uploaded, we are gonna click on this pencil. Let me show you again. All right, this pencil. Yeah, it's called details. So we're gonna click on details and then we will find the video details as you can see. So we are going to pick the title. So what I would usually do is pick a keyword for the title. So if your title contains or includes a keyword, it's gonna be optimized. People are gonna find it a lot easier and it should also be at the limit of 60 characters so don't really make a long 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 title because people don't actually read it you want to keep it short and sweet so uh, in this title i'm gonna type how to get views fast on youtube just as simple as that and then we move to the description so yeah, writing description is one of the most incredible tools for your optimization. And some people neglect it, uh, which is not really the right thing to do. But in this video, I'm going to show you how to do it. So if you really want to know how to use your description in a very optimized way, please watch my video. I have a very detailed video on the use of description, but uh, for the sake of this video, I'm going to let you know the most important thing, which is keeping your description uh, optimized by uh, selecting keywords like how to get more views on YouTube fast. So you should start by a keyword and then you can type a few extra lines, uh, actually three lines, because only the first three lines are going to be visible for your audience. So yeah, we can actually come up with something like getting views in 2022 is very difficult. So watch this video to find out about my secret strategy. for YouTube. Okay, so this is very short and sweet and it also includes all the keywords that I need. And then later we should go to the time codes. We can do it now or you can do it later, but I prefer to do everything all at once. And yeah, we should actually start with an O. Yeah, two O's to make it clickable. Right, here's the intro and let's say for example I start 
my tips at minute two. So when you start with, a, with an O or a zero, you make it clickable. So when people click on those digits, they actually move to the needed part at your video. And then the second or the next step is to let people know about your brand or business or channel. So on Prodvigate, we have this, uh, you know, uh, those few lines that tell people know about our business. So you are going to have the same. Even if you don't have a business channel, even if you have a vlogging channel, you can also do the same because most of your audience are not going to be subscribed to your channel. So you want to let people know about your channel everywhere in your description, in the description of your channel as well. So if you go and watch uh, my video on the use of description, you are going to find incredible ways on how to optimize the description of your videos and the description of your channel. So I really recommend you watching it. And then the next step is hashtags. So make sure that you use the, uh, the hashtags on your videos very strategically because they are very, very important for your optimization. As important as the keywords and the title and also the description. So the first three hashtags are gonna be the ones that are gonna be visible uh, for your audience, but the others are not going to. So make sure to use your first three hashtags very strategically. So in this case, I'm gonna uh, type something like how to get views on YouTube, okay? How to get views in 2022. How to get views fast. So in my case, guys, this is a YouTube channel. So I talk about YouTube, okay? If you're talking about traveling or languages or you talk about cooking or anything else, just make sure that you use those things in your niche, okay? This is just an example because I talk about YouTube and optimization on YouTube. So you can always find those hashtags everywhere on YouTube. If you don't know how to come up with clickable or common hashtags, you can check your competitors. And if you wanna know how your competitors get more views, please watch my video on how to monitor your competitors to learn from them, okay? So I'm not gonna add any more hashtags, but every video has to have 14 hashtags, okay? I'm not gonna add any more hashtags because you get the idea. I'm just gonna move forward to the next step. So the next step is gonna be the thumbnail, okay? So I'm gonna upload a thumbnail in here by selecting it, all right? Here's the thumbnail. So if you are looking forward to creating very good thumbnails, please let me know in the comments and I'm gonna let you know about free ways uh, to make thumbnails that don't require Photoshop or any complicated software. So please let me, in the, let me know in the comments and I'm gonna make a video. I'm gonna make a video about that. So moving to the next step, you're gonna have to add your video to a few playlists, all right? If you are a, or, you know, an already uh, running, up and running channel, but if this is your first video, you probably don't need to create any playlists, but you should always, always add your videos to playlists because when people click on a specific or a particular playlist, they tend to watch all the videos in there. So you want people to binge watch your videos because uh, YouTube is all about getting people's attention and getting people to spend as much time as possible on the platform. So, so if your videos really serve that purpose, YouTube is gonna optimize your videos and the algorithm is gonna get your videos to be watched by as many people as possible on the platform. So never, never, ever lose a chance to get people to watch your videos. And then the keywords, we click on show more and we go to uh, the tags. Okay, so guys, when it comes to tags, a lot of people leave this column blank, unfortunately, but they shouldn't do that because they help a lot. So one of the, the free ways that I usually do to get, you know, these tags, I would go to the YouTube search bar and just type whatever I want, like how to get YouTube views 
fast, for example. Okay, this is a common uh, keyword. So I cut it and paste. Okay, done. As simple as that. So when using the YouTube search bar, you are guaranteed to uh, get as many clickable and searchable keywords as possible because at the end of the day, YouTube is a search engine. So use that to your benefit. So in here, you have to add 14 keywords, 14 tags, and uh, you don't need to do more than that. If you get more than 14 tags, they are not gonna be added. So yeah, make sure to pay attention to that. And if you already have YouTube videos on your channel, make sure to uh, add cards. You can add videos by clicking here on this pencil and then video, and then you choose videos from your channel to get people to watch them as well. And also end, uh, end screens. So yeah, this is it guys. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. Thank you very, very much for your support. You're the reason why we keep running this channel the way we're doing it. So thank you so much again for your support. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. I'll be more than happy to answer your questions in the next video. So that was it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you got any value from this video, please subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss out on any of our future content. Thank you, guys, and see you next time.